This is due to the atoms reacting between the silver nitrate and sodium chloride that used to be dissolved, becoming more ordered and thus precipitating out due to their low solubility. As a reminder, precipitation refers to the formation of a solid substance, a precipitate, from a solution. The formation of a precipitate typically involves a chemical reaction between two or more aqueous, meaning dissolved in water, solutions. When the reaction leads to the production of an insoluble compound, it can no longer remain dissolved in the solution and forms visible solid particles, causing the solution to appear cloudy or exhibit visible particles. A common example of a precipitation reaction is the reaction between AgNO3 plus NaCl going to AgCl plus NaNO3. You pour the silver nitrate, AgNO3, into the sodium chloride, NaCl, or vice versa, which results in the formation of silver chloride, AgCl, a cloudy white compound that precipitates out of the solution. This is due to the atoms reacting between the silver nitrate and sodium chloride that used to be dissolved, becoming more ordered and thus precipitating out due to their low solubility. As a reminder, solubility is the ability of a substance, the solute, to dissolve in a solvent and form homogeneous mixture called a solution. There are two main types of precipitation reactions, double displacement, sometimes referred to as metathesis reactions, and single displacement. Double displacement reactions are the most common type of precipitation reactions where two ionic compounds exchange ions to form a new ionic compound that is insoluble. For example, the aforementioned reaction between silver nitrate, AgNO3, and sodium chloride, NaCl, to form silver chloride, AgCl precipitate, and sodium nitrate, NaNO3. From the reaction, you can see Ag swapping to the Cl, one displacement, and the Na swapping to the NO3, two displacements, therefore double displacement. Single displacement reactions are less common than double displacement. These involve an element directly replacing another element in a compound with a displaced element often forming an insoluble product. For example, in the following reaction, Zn plus CuSO4 going to ZnSO4 plus Cu. Zinc Zn is reacting with the copper sulfate CuSO4 and replaces copper Cu to form zinc sulfate ZnSO4 and the copper metal precipitate. There is one other term to know, which is spectator ions. They are ions that do not participate in the actual chemical reaction, but appear on both sides of the balanced equation with the same coefficients. For example, in the double displacement reaction, AgNO3 plus NaCl going to AgCl plus NaNO3, the sodium and NO3 ions are spectator ions. They are present in both the reactants and products, but do not undergo any chemical change. If you found value in this video, please like it and let people know about the channel because it really does help spread the knowledge. Based on what you learned, think about the following question. Is the reaction of HCl plus NaOH going to NaCl plus H2O a single displacement or double displacement reaction? And what are the spectator ions, if any? Thank you so much for spending your valuable time learning and bettering yourself. If you like the video and want to learn more, donate, or get tutoring, please check out my website, nocollegeneeded.org. You can use the code NCN for 20% off tutoring and any supplemental material.